We've got the Cooper River on one side, and we've got Admiral Wilson Boulevard on the other. So this is where this volunteer dive team, which is based out of Oregon, but has a national following because they put all of their work on YouTube. This is where they focus their efforts today in other parts of South Jersey as well. They've been working with the FBI and Philly police to really narrow their search, hoping that they can make some kind of break in this case. If they're here and their vehicle is underwater, we're, we're getting really close. Back on the water searching for a second day, the volunteer divers from the group Adventures with Purpose are trying to solve the cold case involving Danielle Imbo and Richard Patron, who disappeared in 2005 after a night out at a bar with friends. We're working the theory that when they left Abilene's down on South Street in Philly, they did. They told their friends that they were coming to drop Danielle off out here in Jersey in the Mount Laurel area. Today, Doug Bishop and his team have been using their sonar technology and self-taught skills to scan small bodies of water in South Jersey like the Cooper River here. They suspect the couple got into an accident and ended up underwater. What have you been able to find out from law enforcement in this latest search? Um, I would tell you that law enforcement uh, believes the theory that we are working is the most logical theory. I thank anybody who's trying to help or find justice for Richard. I, I appreciate it so much. I'm very grateful. Earlier this week, Marge Patron, Richard Patron's mother, told me she hopes the divers who searched the Schuylkill River on Tuesday find something. Why are you doing this? What's the purpose? What is your purpose? Uh, to provide families with answers. And we know that, you know, when there's, when it comes to searching underwater, you know, we hold the key to that in all of these cases. You know, we're very good at what we do. This group has been very successful within the past two years. They have helped to solve about 20 cold cases, cases of people who went missing. You may remember just this past weekend, they made a major discovery in Darby Creek, Ridley Township, Delaware County. They found the car of a father and husband who had been missing for nearly 20 years. The human remains found in that car are now working to be positively identified. In terms of this case, the Imbo Patron case, so far right here, this area appears clear. They haven't pinged any cars or anything that they would send their divers in to look at, but they have some more bodies of water to search. They actually were supposed to wrap up their efforts today. They think they will stay t uh, through tomorrow and likely will end up on the Delaware River. They'd like to search between uh, the Ben Franklin Bridge and Betsy Ross Bridge. Reporting live in Camden County, I'm Rosemary Connors, NBC 10 News.